We are at the end of uh, the Marco Polo scientific expedition, uh, whose main goals were to uh, investigate the relationship between uh, genes, environment, and lifestyle across uh, the Silk Road. We choose uh, this traditional and cultural path in, in which uh, human beings uh, exchanged for many, many centuries uh, goods, uh, ideas, and also uh, genes. And, uh, and this has been done simply because still there is in this place a lot of uh, uh, what we call biodiversity, there are a lot of different ethnic groups, uh, but a common, in some way, environmental uh, background. Uh, they eat more or less the, the same kind of foods, and uh, they have many things uh, in common among them. We already genotyped uh, uh, most of the samples we already collected. It was a very tough uh, journey to collect them because we sampled uh, in the field uh, without no facilities in many cases, uh, in some cases without no uh, electricity. Uh, but at the story, we are very happy and satisfied because the, the sample collection was uh, good enough. We collected more than 1,500 samples. And now we are uh, applying next generation sequencing to get much more information uh, on their genome and to share such kind of information uh, with other scientists working on uh, uh, human genome projects, 1,000 genome projects, and so on. In terms of results, we, we found uh, extremely interesting things uh, related to uh, sense organs and genes related to sense organs, such as uh, genes involved in taste, genes involved in, in food preferences, um, smell, uh, and hearing. And in particular, we found uh, relevant differences uh, uh, across our, the population we collected in terms of taste uh, behavior, in bitter perception, different bitter perceptions, uh, different uh, uh, levels of food preferences, uh, very interesting results on, uh, on smell uh, and their ability in, in identifying different odorants as well as uh, hearing. So that's it. This is the last day of uh, three years of uh, scientific expedition across the Silk Road. But the work is not finished here. We are going back to Italy and going back in the lab. And uh, there is a lot of work to be done uh, and uh, hopefully nice results to be, to, to be uh, obtained in the near future.